Hey you guys, another review on the roll today. I had to make sure I include this in my, my weeks of, of, of re review of dates. This is the Cantu Extra Cold Edge Stay Gel. I, uh, this is the package. It comes in this package. Okay, $4.99 for this bad boy. And Cantu, a little backstory, is one of my favorite companies. It's been around forever. As you can see, this is what it looks like. It comes in a jar like this. It, it has the same print as the uh, other products, especially the natural hair product line in Cantu. Looks like this. And this is what it looks like. It's orange base, which is good. As long as it's not white base, it was, won't leave like a cast. So it is like a light orangey base, amber looking color. And as you can see, I have put a dent in this bad boy. I've had it for about a month. As far as my edges, I don't use a whole lot of product on my edges because my edges are a little on the thinner end now. Unfortunately, it's hereditary for me to have thinner, uh, a thinner hair, hairline. So this is what it looks like. It's growing in, it's growing back nicely. So I try not to use a whole lot of products on my hair. But when I do see new products, especially from Cantu and stuff like that, I was like, hmm, I'll break my little rule. So I've used it. I love this stuff. This stuff has great hold. First of all, the smell is great. The price is great. You can find this now. I'm starting to see it more and more at most uh, beauty supply stores and also more um, commercial based stores like Walmart and things like that. So this is what it looks like. And it is more of a, it's not super sticky, tacky, but it's like a, like a gel, a, a thicker gel. It's like really smooth. I really love the texture. That's one of my issues with a lot of edge control. It's, it's too stiff. It's too tacky. It's a little too thick and gunky. But this right here is like a nice gel, smooth gel. It's a little, a little firm, but nothing super tacky. Let's see if I can get my little edges to act right. Let me get my little brush. Do a little demo. Let's see. I'm not wearing any edge control right now. I'm just going to put it across the front. Use my fingers before I use the brush. Normally I just use my fingers. Shout out to my forehead. It's all up in there. Uh, and my hair is just like laying right now. I have really coarse, thick hair. So my hair does not lay down easy. So I'm just using my fingers. I put a little too much in the same spot, which do not use a whole lot, especially like in the same spot like I just did. But I'm just this is just for a demo. Um, it lays down instantly just with my fingers. Normally I have to use a brush and lay it down with a scarf and then wait maybe five ten minutes for it to lay flat. But I'm going to just use a brush, and this is a soft board bristle brush. I do not use brushes on my hair often. If I do, I normally use like something like a soft board bristle brush. It has a shrink in it. Okay. And we're going to lay this down. And like I said, I use, normally use my fingers. And I did use a little bit too much. And it, it's like flat. Like, it's cool. Like that. So, I love this stuff. This stuff holds really well. And as you can see, I'm slicking my hair in a puff. I'm going to do a bun. So, I may feel it, maybe. I may use this stuff. But I highly recommend if you're looking for a good edge control, something that's su not super expensive, not super oily, not super uh, gunky and thick, tacky feeling, like stickiness and stuff like that. I highly recommend this one. This is like the bomb.com. I love this. I will definitely repurchase this. It normally takes me a while to use up a tub of edge control. And um, this is 2.25 ounces. So it you only need like a little bit. As you can see, I put too much. And this is what happens when you put too much. But this is just a demo. I'm about to co-wash my hair anyway. So yeah. And um, definitely like highly recommend it. If you see it in the stores, this is what it's gonna look like. I highly recommend it, you guys. Go try it out. It's not, like it's there's no mineral oil, sulfates, paraben, silicone, false face, gluten, paraffin, propyl paraffin, whatever, and no DEA, you know, like, you know, it's, just, it's all good, and it's just, like, really nice, and you should really go buy it, and just try it, like, I really like it, I like all of their products, minus the custard, 
So, you know, go out, try it. This is the you guys next time. Yeah. <laughs>